this this luggage was designed specifically for this purpose, and we don't know of any other technique that they used. No, but that's a caliber flatwood. Is that right? One of our agents that was working undercover. Uh, yes, is that the Cobb flatwood? Right. Well, this uh, is the suitcase, one of the two suitcases used to smuggle the heroin into the United States. It's a rather unique uh, type of uh, smuggling uh, piece of equipment here in that the shells are made for the outer side of the suitcase rather than for the inside, making it possible for a person to inspect the inside of the luggage, see the lining inside intact, and even if they pull the lining up and looked up underneath it, they would see the uh, shell in, that they would normally find in the suitcase. And the, uh, the heroin then is concealed on the outer side of this. This was riveted in and it had the appearance of being that way when it was uh, originally uh, manufactured. Three out of five major European and South American rings, heroin rings, have been in effect busted in the past uh, uh, couple of years. Does this indicate uh, the fact that there is oriental heroin coming in, that there is a, uh, that replacements in effect are coming in for these various rings that you have busted? We feel that there is a, a, a definite uh, trend this direction, that, uh, that the heroin from the Far East is uh, brought in to, in effect, uh, fill the void that has occurred in the, as a result of the uh, elimination of some of the major suppliers that operated out of Europe and, and through South America. Wherever the, uh, you plug up the dike, uh, water comes over some other place. Well, that, to some degree, uh, uh, we, we haven't had uh, anywhere near the amount of heroin uh, coming in as, uh, from the Far East as we have removed from the, uh, from the market coming out of Europe, however. We've had uh, the most successful year this past year that we've ever had. And, uh, uh, not only in the terms of the seizures of large quantities of heroin, but the elimination of the organizations that are uh, responsible for the distribution, which really has a greater impact than the actual removal of the heroin.